Welcome to my channel Emax Engineering Branded by Jinder Mahabub Ahmad Khan. In this video, I will show you if you have an outlet, you are some appliances are working like your fan, some water, etc. And you want to check whether it's working on AC supply or DC supply because you don't know maybe you are new at some places and you are working at somewhere, you don't know it's working on AC or DC supply and how you will check it's AC or DC supply. Uh, here I will tell you I have one battery here. Okay, uh, you will see I put my meter on DC selection volt. Here is DC volt. Here I am checking negative with black lead and red with positive. Its voltage is at 12.6 volt if you can see. Here two, I will discuss two methods. If I change leads here, this to this, you see here, it's negative sign with 12.6 volt. One method is this one, you will connect your meter with outlet, with supply, with wire, with connection. You will see here voltage. If you will change your lead, mean first you connected here at lead, then here at lead. If you see here a matter sign, it means your supply is positive. Uh, sorry, it means it's your supply is DC supply. Uh, it's not AC supply. Uh, if you will see here, now I am checking, I am going to check on AC system. I have an outlet and you will see here. I will put my meter on AC. And if you are able to see here voltage are 219 volt. Okay. Now I will change this. Red lead I will put here, black lead here. Then even then you will see there is value, but there is no sign here, no negative sign. It means DC supply is polarity sensitive, AC supply is not polarity sensitive. If you will change AC system, AC knob, if you will change your meter knob, then there will be no symbols of negative here. In DC supply there will be symbol. Uh, now I will discuss what I will now I will tell you about other method how you will check. Now you have put your knob on AC board. If you put it on DC, there will be no reading here. Look, it's zero. If you will put your meter on DC, it will show you zero. It means it's AC supply because on, on DC meter is not giving any return. But on DC meter is not giving any reading. So it is AC supply because your ambulances are working on it. Of course there is supply, it means there is AC. Now you will see here, I put on DC here, it's okay. I change here now, it's getting minus positive also. But if I will change now to AC, it will show you zero value. But you are fine, the motor is working. If there is no supply here, it's working. It means supply is AC here. So it means supply is DC here because your meter is on AC. Now I have discussed two methods. Number one, uh, you will check on battery leads. Now it's just it is an example on battery. You will check your outlet, your connection of fans. You will change first. You will check with first. You will check in one direction. Then you will see reading. After that you will change lead. Mean black and red lead. You will interchange with each other. Then you will see reading. If reading have changed their sign. Before there was no sign but negative sign came or before there was negative sign but no sign disappeared. It means supply is DC. Uh, if by changing there is no sign in both cases there is only nothing here. It means supply is AC. This was one of the methods. Second, you will put your meter on AC and you will check meter is showing nothing there is zero volt. Uh, but your fan is working, something whatever with ambulances is working. It means supply is available but not AC, it's DC. Same as you will put here DC and you will check the meter, meter is showing zero value. But supply is giving power to your ambulances, it means power is available but it's AC. I think you understand it very well. If you have any questions, you will. If you have any questions, you can ask me in comments. I will explain you very well, inshallah.